this is an opportunity to show how art can be expressive in many different ways other than just something hanging on a wall. Fashion is art and this takes art and fashion and marries it together. And we have a full house. There's probably close to 375, 400 people here. People are excited to see what these kids come up with. Arts are typically underfunded and we were trying to figure out a way to raise funds and this idea came up and it has just exploded from there. It's a total buy-in, they're very passionate about what they do. We've been able to raise enough funds to buy digital tablets. We bought 25 digital tablets and using those for a brand new class, digital painting and illustration. This year we bought a pug mill for a ceramic class where we can recycle clay. And you're talking about these things are several thousand dollars. We had two segments. The first segment and the finale were what we're calling recycled and unconventional materials. And essentially the kids took materials that you wouldn't normally see on something that you would wear. Um, we had a foodie segment. This was new this year. We wanted to involve the community even more. So we went out and asked the local fast food places if they would donate supplies. They were all in. They were very excited. And in return, they get to take the outfit and display it at their store. The cardboard mask, we've done that every single year. That's always a hit. We've been selling denim jackets every year. This year we had a theme. We had um, album covers and famous artwork. Um, and then we had what we call trompe l'oeil, and that just, it fools the eye. And I actually made all of the dresses out of window shade fabric and the vest, and then we painted them to look, kind of fool the eye. I'm a big fan of this program, big fan of Miss Moore and the other art teachers. I like to keep this going, I like to help it out a little bit, so hopefully I can do that. I'm wearing a dress that I sewed completely um, out of canvas from old painting scraps and then these pieces right here are tarps with old paint on them and I just sewed them in a ribbed pattern up here and with ruffles down here. 